Today, guys, we're doing another great game debate on the game that you might know as Terraria. Stop. No, why? Why do you guys do... Okay. Are you guys done yet? <laughs> Uh, no. Yeah, thank God. Because I don't think I would get as many views as I would <gasps> Grenade! He's <laughs> just like screaming grenade at the top of my lungs. Anyways, um. Anyways, what's going on, guys? Today, we. We are doing a, another great game debate. Um, so without further ado, let's get into this. So, guys, uh, we're doing one of Terraria t today, correct? So, so you played to uh, a Terraria, right, guys? Oh, really? <laughs> Tony, I swear to God, I will kill you. Um, what, I'm sorry, what? Okay, guy, but but in all seriousness, I, I, I want your, when both of yours, actual, just, uh, like, reviews of the game. It good. <laughs> I love how, how, how Tim's like, it's alright. And, and like, so I to get, like, all, all like, Philosophical and Tyler go, ain't good. <laughs> <laughs> what? Igor? What are you. <laughs> I for from Minecraft. So next time on Minecraft Story Mode. <laughs> How did we go from talking. This is not. Uh, we're doing Terraria stream, not freaking. Whatever this is. This is top. <laughs> no, no, not no, not <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! You idiot! <laughs> Oh my, can we talk about Terraria for, for, for an, <laughs> dear god, what is this, chat, this is why you never do anything like this, never have friends, I don't, I, the, the, wait, wait, what's the one name, this is why I don't have friends, they disappoint me, <laughs> yeah, and then she does like a, like a dab. Oh, who's sending messages in general? No. <laughs> Stop sending Terraria. There's 96 new messages. <laughs> Why are you guys doing this? Guys, come on. I'm just trying to record a freaking video. Alright. Alright. Okay. Let's talk about Terraria. W okay. W okay, do you guys have spamming general? I, I, I know it's Tyler. Uh, oh, I, I'm still getting messages. I don't know. Uh, oh, that's weird. But, um... Yeah? Okay. Okay. Mm, 
No, I don't like when this is... <laughs> what? What? I'm sorry. Oh, hey, thanks for the follow. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, no. I'm Hitler. Also, uh, Tyler, thank you for that story. Because the second you send us that story, I, I actually gotta follow. So thank you. <laughs> thanks for the story, man. It gave me a follower. <laughs> Also, thank you to, to uh, Dr. David and Spanker's Kingdom for following. <laughs> oh, God. Anyways, alright. Should we talk about Terraria now? <laughs> Probably. Okay, so, um... Y you guys like Terraria, right? <clears throat> so, um... Uh, do you guys have, like, a favorite boss? Or, like, a boss that you thought was, like... The most fun to fight. Really, all that, huh? Okay. All right. I hmm. kind of think. I don't know who my favorite boss would be. No, who? Uh, no boss. I really liked. The the boss I really liked was um, what was his name? Uh, Duke Fishron. I really liked his boss fight. Hey, do you guys know what I'm talking about? Yeah. What's that sound? Is something like building in Minecraft or something like that? Yeah, well, what's that sound, guys? Anyone know? Okay, guys, uh, let's talk about uh, uh, Terraria. So, uh, go. Favorite boss. Tony, the uh, favorite boss. Mhm. Mm oh really? Oh really? Huh? Yeah. I mean, I really like modded bosses. Like, I play a lot of modded. As as a matter of fact, guys. Um. So, I played, like, not even, like, a minute of normal uh, vanilla Terraria when I got it on Steam. And then immediately then downloaded t -T Mod Loader. And now, I think my log time is, like, what, like, 283 hours, something like that. So, I, so I spent, uh, like, a, a little... Uh, no, it probably be over, because I'm not counting, like, the minutes or anything like that. So, so I spent over 283 hours on mods. So, I, I, I recommend it. Yes. Mhm. Mm well, are are you watching the stream? Are you watching the stream? Is that why? <laughs> you stupid. <laughs> it's just the guys. I don't understand. I'm listening to you guys talk. In, in more than one tab, and I'm hearing you talk twice. I don't understand. Dear God, no, this is terrible. I slash awful everything. <laughs> um, all right. Okay. 
sounds good. So, shall we talk to talk about yeah, uh, Terraria? Okay. So, um, okay. One one thing I want to talk about though is the the, the, diff the the difference between Terraria and Minecraft because I see them compared a lot, and I mean a lot. As a matter of fact. Even Tony himself, he, he used to call it a Terraria 2D Minecraft. Yes. Yeah, he, yeah. He, I, I, it really annoyed me. Tony, what do you have to say? What, what do you have to say for yourself? You, you called it 2D Minecraft. For the first like month that we played the game. Is that true or not? And that's that's what I thought. But one thing I want to say is that I don't think they should be compared because they are completely two they are two completely different things. Like, yes, they are very... They have some similarities. Yeah. Like, you know... Sandbox games, basically. Uh, they're both sandbox games, so... But... Yeah, yeah, adventure sandbox, all that stuff. Um, but... The thing... But the thing is that, that I really liked about Terraria, and I found it differing between... Minecraft and Terraria. Not to say that that either of them is better or worse, because it depends on what I want to do. Because if I want to have like an adventure and fight bosses and get loot and stuff like that, I'm gonna play Terraria. Because even like with mods, Minecraft is significantly worse with that than Terraria is. Because Terraria was built for that type of thing. Minecraft was built for building, or mainly building. So if 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 I'm gonna build and make cool big creations, I'm I'm gonna go with Minecraft. Not to say that there are not amazing builders in Terraria, because oh my God, there are some amazing builds in that game that must take years. And and also not to say that that there aren't good adventuring mod packs for Minecraft like like RL Craft and Crazy Craft. I'm just I'm gonna say playing mods like a uh, Calamity. Or Tremor, or Thorium, or, or Juice Mod, or some of those, to a lot more fleshed out than RL Craft. But still, go check out um, RL Craft and Crazy Craft. Great mod packs. We play them all, all the time. Um, it, it's just super cool. Um. And the next thing I, I wanted to start talk, talking about was, how, so how do you feel about the game being over? I mean, it's it's done. I mean, yes, we have the community to like keep it going with mods and stuff like that, but I mean, still, that's that's not the same as you know new updates. And I mean, I'm gonna be completely honest. No offense t to them. But, but this new update was kind of underwhelming. Like, I mean, it added, like, a few new bosses. But, I mean, that's that's about... And it added some, like, stupid NPCs, like, the golfer. Why? When will we ever use a golfer in, in Terraria? Well, like, yes, we can use it to make some interesting things, but, I mean, like, use it... For you know, uh, conventionally, because it because it, it, the golfer doesn't really have any conventional use, and like same thing with most of the other ones. Where if they added something like the alchemist NPC, like from the uh, the alchemist NPC mod, then that would mi uh, be a lot more interesting and would also, you know, be more helpful and more, and more conventional because everyone hates making potions. It's the least, and, and that's why like. Most people don't even use them. Like I like I only use potions if I find them in like a chest or something like that. But I never, I don't like. I think I made potions like once or twice, and both times, I'm pretty sure it was to get um, hellstone. 
Because of the, of the wipe. It's just so annoying to get Hellstone. Unless you have, uh, what, what's it called? Um, I want to say fire resistance, but uh, I know that's Minecraft. Uh, but you know what I'm talking about. And, um, another thing is I feel like the the game just sort of ends because, like, the Moon Lord doesn't really feel like a final boss, which is my only problem with him. Is he, is he doesn't really feel like the, you know, this is the be-all, end-all of existence, let's fight! Uh, because all you really need to do is just hide inside next to a nurse. And, like, yes, that is the cowardly way of fighting him, but, I mean... Well, yeah, yeah, but, I mean, but at the same time, I feel like a final boss shouldn't be able to be defeated that easily. I mean, it shouldn't just be, you know, hang inside next to another per person, and then that's it, they're, they're, they're just, that's the entire boss fight. So, so I feel like the Moon Lord didn't, and besides, like, the, the, the Moon Lord himself, didn't really feel like it would be the final boss of Terraria. Like, I mean, like, it was not like the final boss of Terraria was called, like, it wasn't like the guy turned in, in, in the final boss or something. That would be a good twist at the end. Is that it's just like the guy did the final boss or something like that. Or turns into the final boss. That, that would be cool because the guy was with you from the start and has been there ever since. So that would make sense. But... The Moon Lord just didn't really fit in anywhere. I mean, like, yes, he is the final boss, but, I mean, he didn't really... F he felt like he was part of, like, another game, like... And, I mean, like, yeah, don't get me wrong, there are eyes everywhere. Like, there's eyes, and there's worms, and there's all this stuff. Not, none of that really fits with the theme. But, but I mean, like... Meh. Also, I was expecting this update to have a lot more stuff. Like, I mean, there has been, like, so many bosses that, that the community has been uh, requesting for, for like, mo like, you know what, I was going to say months, but years. Like, um, the, like, first things first, is they wanted to, is they wanted them to re-add, uh, Okram. Also, why can't you just leave? Um, but they, uh, maybe. But, I mean... Like, Okram. That sh should have been re-added. The Okram. That would be a, um... That'd be a good thing to, get, you know, add again. But the problem with that is that Okram is... Wasn't very fleshed out, and that's why, and that's why they removed him. If, if they could actually, you know, sort of... Make him make sense where he is. And, you know, fix everything. You know, like a normal game dev would do, and to just uh, remove. Uh, yeah, it was added, but I mean, it doesn't really do much. I mean, in uh, the in the journeys up in in the journeys end update. Oh. I, n well, I'm pretty sure it's because it, it's technically a mini biome, and, and I don't think it just naturally spawns. I think the way that I believe, or the last I've heard of it, is they said it would spawn by, like, if you placed a, b a bunch of graves in a very close proximity. Yeah, I don't know. Or that was uh, the last I heard, but that, uh, but that was, like, a year ago, so Th they could have easily changed that. Oh, yeah, 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 and, um, okay, my huge problem with the game, though, is they should have, with this last update, instead of releasing Team Out Loader completely separately, implemented some of the more popular, um, like, mods to make certain things easier, instead of just releasing completely, and don't get me wrong, I... Completely agree that you should have a, a release team mod loader because it is a, because modding is a huge part of what makes Terraria Terraria. 
like same thing and like I mean I'm still waiting for Minecraft to do that type of thing because they because that's definitely one of those games where it deserves that there's just I and I f am kind of m mad that 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 you know Minecraft just like I mean Terraria is doing it why don't you just like you know or, or release Forge as like a separate thing like I mean would that really hurt or if, or if anything j just make your own thing like team mod loader you could download the mods from in the game itself why don't you just do something like that Tyler it's nothing uh, I I you just weren't talking so I know you you weren't saying much okay so it's just it's um it, it was weird but so I didn't really know how to feel about it But um, I mean, at the same time, um, I really do applaud them for you know being able to admit one of the big reasons we're we we are so popular as we are now is because of these mods, because the modding community brought so much uh, out of the game than it originally had. So I mean, if if it wasn't for for mods, I mean, like certain people, like I mean, so many people wouldn't be drawing attention to it. Like I mean, Chippy Gaming, that guy's entire channel is Terraria mods. So I mean, and like, think about how many people have really gotten into Terraria, like owned the game before and didn't really play it, or just didn't have the game and just saw that, and got into it because of him, because he has. A bunch of subscribers. I actually don't know how many sub the does he has have. Yeah, I know he was in the hundred thousand the last time I. I mean, when I was watching him, but that was a like a that was like a, in in the middle of the school year. So I mean, that was a while ago. Chippy Gaming YouTube. Yeah, let me open this. Let's see how many subs he has now. Set 758k. Nice. Good. Good for him. Oh, and and, and then there's uh, Chippy's couch, which which does not have as much. Yeah, but Chippy's couch, in my opinion, is. Normally, it's a little bit better. <gasps> what the? That's pretty cool. Um, uh, oh nothing. I was just so sorry. I I was looking at um uh, the the em the Empress of uh I just saw an image of an Empress of Light. Those uh, that that new boss. Yeah. So I I just saw an image of it. So that was pretty cool. And don't get me wrong. But but know what? I'm so glad there's one thing that they did. They finally added the queen slime. Since the king slime was added, people have been asking f for that. And I but, I but at the same time, they also missed out on a bunch of other ones that people have been asking. Like for instance, the obliterator is well, they throw they throw around names a lot, but a popular one was the obliterator, and it, and it was supposed to be like the destroyer, but even more upgraded. Like, I uh, like know how the Eater World was upgraded to the Destroyer. They were asking for, uh, enough to, to the, er, to, like, a third tier other Destroyer to be, like, the, the Obliterator. But, or, well, other names were like that, but basically a third tier, um, a Destroyer. And, and another one that was really popular was uh, the Triplets. Uh, the Triplets or quadruplets was another one. They were very popular ideas. That got thrown around a lot because they would make good bosses, or at least in my opinion, I think that they would make good bosses. However, there were other um, ones that were not so good. Oh, oh, hey, Tony. Phone died? Well, Okay. 
I don't have a phone. We don't use phones. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Uh, w okay, all right, all right. Okay, um, but anyways, guys, um, me and Tyler, me and Tyler, well, m well mainly me, we we're, were talking about popular ideas of bosses that they didn't add. Uh, like, the only popular, like, one of the only popular fan bosses that they did end up adding was the Queen Slime. Which, which many uh, people wanted to be a tier two of the King Slime. Um, but then, then there was uh, another um really popular one that in uh, what was it? Skeltron Prime. I'm pretty sure that 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 was another one. Th this one was the least popular of those three mechanical bosses, but I mean it, it still it still existed. It was called like Skeltron Optimal or something like that, or like that was a popular name. It was pretty dumb. Um, but basically, I mean, the idea was he had like twelve arms or something like that, and and like he, he was like, and, and and like each of his original arms were like made ten times worse. Like I mean, uh, like I, I remember the the one was uh, I know the, how he had the flamethrower arm. Well, uh, they, they had the idea to, to replace that with, uh, do, uh, do you know the green flames that give, that give you poison and set you on fire? Yeah, they wanted to replace them with that. Replace that with that. So, so, so he had a flame sh flow of the up them. And he wanted, to, and they wanted to replace the, um, the, what's it called? The, his bullets and his gun with the nanite, not nanite, oh my god. Uh, well, that was another one, but they, but mainly it was chlorophyte bullets that they were saying that they should replace them with. Oh yeah, no, and like obviously there are so many reasons why this one was not uh, added, and I mean, I knew for a fact if they were gonna add any of these, it would most likely be either the, like the king slime or the triplets, because like those are like the easiest ones to do, and they're the most, you know. Understandable ones, uh, as you do, where, where they wouldn't be, be like, be, be, because some of it just sounds like, I want you to add a rainbow sparkle princess w with dragon wings. And it's just like, and they're just like, I don't understand. I've asked them, I've emailed them like ten times. Why, why haven't they added added it yet? But like, I mean, these were some okay ideas. Granted, yes, there were many better ones. Well, I mean, I I did like uh, the idea of trip, like uh, the triplets. I like the queen slime idea, and I like the, and I like the, okay, and I like the obl the obliterator idea. H however, I yeah, the the, obl uh, the obliterator that was another really interesting idea that I liked. Yes. Wait, 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 go ahead, go. Yeah. That was actually like So a really popular idea was actually like what you're describing for him to send out a mini destroyer. The original idea that was just for him to spawn for him to spawn entire destroyers, which obviously was, was a bit overpowered. So I don't understand how people think like, oh, let's make a boss that spawns infinite amounts of moon lords unless we kill him fast enough. This 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 makes sense. Every two seconds. 